So what's up guys, the Mirror Free 5 back here and today is the new episode of our Terraria Let's Play. Alright, first of all I want to finally collect the Blink Root to make uh, the Swiftness Potion which would be used in the Eye of Tooth fight. Um, because last episode everything was alright but I forgot to buy at least some healing potions and I really wanna do that right now as quickly as possible. Uh, because I may forget it later on. So let's go ahead to our merchant and quickly buy some healing potions. Because these things are really useful. Alright. So let's get some of those. And um, okay, let's go to the guide. And I want to know how to make um, greater ones. Okay, we need glowing mushrooms. Well, this is tricky because um, if I remember, we haven't found the glowing mushroom underground, things like that in our world yet. But we may find that soon. Okay, never mind then. Um, let's go ahead and do some mining and hopefully find a blink root, some blink roots. And maybe we have some potions which should be useful in the underground yeah we have a mining potion um, okay let's take one and I think this would be just enough for us to go ahead and have some fun um, exploring our caves the only thing I wonder about is where should we go but we'll understand that in a few moments okay giant worm just once I go into the caves these guys appear and they want to ruin everything all right thank you notice hey i want to get rid of you giant worm may you please go here so we can shoot you up okay he's tricky he's trying to trick us but we're smart enough to beat this guy off yep that's how it goes Alright, we may go to the left, this will be slightly useful. And there was this awesome, like, temple <laughs> underground thing, last episode we found that one. And I want to explore that a little bit more, so why not go ahead there and start searching for fun things. Okay, here we go. I don't want this water to spoil oil all around the cave so I would be as sneaky as possible just to do something like this okay uh, yep that's the right way so now we should be able to go through this little place also it would be nice to find some silver or some iron don't know because it may help us it may really help us Alright, there are a lot of slimes here, but we'll fight them off real quick. Yee, um, what's happening here? There is another scary place, but we'll be alright with that. Okay, we have cactus, which is great, because we need it for uh, crafting uh, the uh, swiftness potion. Alright, never mind, uh, what do we have here? Some more random caves all right don't see any blink root yet but i think we'll be lucky enough to find some oh there is some iron let's go ahead and mine it because i've noticed that one. okay that's elite i always say because these are like the same ores i mean by their like greatness <laughs> by their power with the weapons and with the armor but they have different names, of course. And let's start mining there and basically use the mining potion. So now we'll be super fast miners in Terraria. Oh, and that's some silver, which is really great because I wanted to find some of that. Yeah. The only thing it, it, that would be great to, to have um is uh, the 
potion which shows the location of ores, treasures and stuff. But I don't know how to obtain that, so never mind. We'll be fine even without it. There is some more lead. Let's collect it of course. Oh, and there is also some silver, if I'm not misunderstanding anything. Okay, how do we go there? What should do the trick? Something like this. And now we place a torch here. And we're good to go, we're ready to mine. And collect our best ever silver ore. There is this slime, I don't want him to get here. Please just go away and don't mess around with us. Because we're strong ones, we're strong terrarians. It will be hard for you to make any harm to us. And there is some more silver, which is awesome. Because maybe you will craft some better armor. And this would be really useful. And there is some glowing ore, I don't remember the name of it. But in the left bottom part of the screen, you may have noticed also, there is something glowing with red color and I bet that's some kind of an ore. So let's have a look what interesting stuff that could be. <laughs> How do we get there? Okay, there is a path. And we're here. What the heck is this? And can we even mine it? And maybe that's not even an ore. Okay, we can't even mine it. Maybe that's cream, cream stone, cream tin, or something like this. Okay, but we should use the full potential of our mining potion and do some more mining and exploring around while we have the potion effect. Okay, okay. Some random spot, but nothing interesting here. Should we go up there? Don't really want to. I hope we'll find something interesting here. But no blink root, like not even a single one. This makes me a bit sad. Because I thought it would be really easy to find some blink root. But seems like nope. Terraria doesn't want us to get the swiftness potion that easy. We should pass all the tricky <laughs> quests to complete this hard task. Okay, I would even leave the lead ore just to find some blink root. At least two. Two swiftness potions would do the trick, guys. That would be just enough for us to make to complete the Eye of Tulhu fight. Okay, there is some lead, which would be useful, there is slimy, willing to kill us, and there is a worm also, but we are powerful now. Okay, Spelunker Potion, is it? Yep, it shows the location of treasures and ores. Let's drink it straight off. Whoa, ho, ho. <laughs> that's a lot of great stuff. Let's not miss our time and let's go for some mining. Okay. Well, a hook may be useful too, so let's collect these gems over there. Shine potion. Does it make you shine? Yep, makes us extra. <laughs> don't know, extra lights, lightning, and stuff. But we don't need that for the moment. What is this? It is amethyst. Yep. If we find 10 more, then we'll be able to make a grappling hook. But that's not that easy to do. Okay. I hope there is some silver over there. Um, what's happening here? Oh, there is a blink root. I see it. <laughs> I see it, guys. Finally, we found one. That is the best thing ever. Okay, first of all, I'll collect this silver real quick. And then go straight ahead and pick up our first ever blink root in this 
to a real world. Yay, finally! Terraria gives us a present that we long awaited for. That is awesome. Okay, we'll be will we be able to get there using this path? Maybe, who knows? Should try it out by yourself. Alright. How do I get there? Can we jump here? Yep, thank you. Oh, and there is a yellow slimy protecting this blink root from bad guys. Okay, don't kill us please. Alright, and now we can take that. Awesome. Um, maybe we'll be lucky enough to find some more. Who knows? Hmm. There is just cobweb, just some useless items, yes I understand, nothing really interesting here, so we should get away real quick and try collecting some more resources and ores. Okay, there is another slime that wants to kill us. But we'll make him go away just as quickly as possible uh, all right something here oh there is a golden chest let's see if we can find something great there inside the chest maybe we'll be lucky enough but at least we have one greater healing potion and there is a mushroom growing over there, which can be used for the dice, as I believe, which is also a fun thing to have. Also great to have. Okay, okay, okay. Go on there. <laughs> How do I mine all these blocks? And I want to get my chest. Please give me my chest. <laughs> we made it what's inside oh finally a magic mirror really finally Truria gives us the magic mirror potion great mm. what don't I need hardened scent I believe and maybe this mushroom oh and we have oh that's an iron skin okay Never mind then. I want this golden chest to be in my inventory also. Okay. Oh, was it something? No, that's not blink root. Never mind. Okay. We have 10 seconds left of this awesome potion. Simon Six, no. It's getting away. <laughs> The awesome effect, new. No. Alright. Let's have a look. There was this mushroom somewhere. Oh, yep. Lucky enough to find that one. Just again. Just as always. How do I pick you up? Okay. Um, what should I remove? Stars. I can craft the mana crystal. Oh. Did we use it straight off? Oh no, we didn't use it. So let's do something like that. Use the mana crystal and take back the green mushroom. And it's not usable as I think. Yep, yeah, it's used for the green dye. Oh, 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 what the freak? What is that? <laughs> that was a screamer. That was scary enough, to be honest. Okay, let's hope that we won't end up dying over here. Hey, hey, how do I get the minecart? Alright, now I take the life crystal. Um, what do I remove? Please tell me what do I remove. Okay, let it be sunflower this time, sorry. And there is this crazy thing. Hate it, just get away. 
there is this Antlon, I believe something like that is his name. These ones are crazy. They can kill you. Okay. Things are getting real tricky. I'm losing the controls and there are too many of these freaking enemies which are hard, hard to fight. And they really want to kill me. But I want to stay alive. <laughs> okay. Just go away from me, please. Don't do anything bad to me. And I won't even touch you. But they don't want to go away that simple. So we should give them a fight. They want a real fight. Okay, then. I would remove this one block and hopefully oh they got here they got here will they beat me up no I would lock them here just like that but I don't have any lives remaining just... okay I want to get the silver and then just get hell out of here get the hell out of here this place is full of those bad guys that want to eat me for just nothing but I'm not that easy to kill okay let me get my silver finally um should place some wooden platforms so it would be easy for us to go around here and then remove this block and now we're good to go, ready to collect our silver. So I think it will be even enough for some armor set, which is amazing. Do we have elite pickaxe? Yeah, we should make a silver one later. Alright, things are going on pretty nice. So collecting the final parts okay there's another bad guy running here he wanna kill us he wanna destroy us and I just wanna get the ore and fly away back home that's all I wanna do for now so bye <laughs> yay finally made it back here and we have the blink root which was the best thing to do to have Okay, have cactus, have blink root. The only thing remaining is to get some uh, glass, I believe. And then we should be able to make this, uh, where are those bottles? I think so. Okay, we have some bottles. Uh, do we have any water around here? Okay, there's some water, I believe. If we go there, we should be able to make the thing used for the potions. Okay, let's have a look. So we're in the water now. Yep, we can make bottled water. Let's remove the glass and make as much as we can for the potions. I hope that's the right one. I mean the bottled water. Because maybe we should have made something different. But I'm not sure. So let's just have a look. Let's go here and place it on the table if we can. Oh, can't we? So what did I do? Okay, first of all, <laughs> let's get back here. Get rid of the zombies that are trying to beat us, as always. Um, and make our worse. Okay, there's platinum, some lead also. Alright. What do we have here? Making our lead. Right. And now a load of silver. Finally, that's what I wanted to have. Great. Now we have tons of ore. Some bars remaining. Actually, tons of bars. Some more remain. Okay. Uh, where is my 
<clears throat> inventory slots and things like that. Okay, it's over here. Yep, we should make a better armor, obviously. So, what does your helmet do? Okay, not not so so much difference, I would say. And this also. All right. So let's make just elite helmet then. Don't know really, cause there's nothing else to do with it. Honestly. Okay. What do we do now? Is replace our mining helmet with the lead one, and place the mining helmet into the chest with fun stuff. Oh, there is another golden chest, so we can finally use it for some interesting things. And I will place it here. Okay. Do we have any uh, gems somewhere? Not really. Great. Then what I would do, make some more glass. Make two bottles and see if we can place them over here so now we should be able to make potions um if i understand everything correctly uh, starting bottle no that's not what i want to make maybe some gist or several at least um hmm. do i take this okay then the green root and the cactus and maybe, if I'm lucky, I would be able to craft something here. Let's have a look. Can we? Swiftness, yay! Swiftness potion, awesome. Main that one, easy. So now we have the thing that we were aiming for. A swiftness potion. And some iron skins. Okay, let's leave that here. Also take the swiftness with us. This I wouldn't need. Okay, we have two of those. Shine potion also don't need for the moment. This I would leave here. Okay, the bottle goes back. Cactus goes back. Tons of cobweb, maybe. It's used for something. Okay, where do I place the smasher? <clears throat> I have no idea at the moment. Okay, let it go over there. And we're, we're obviously ready for the fight. Um, the only thing is I would really want to have some better healing potions, some greater ones. But this is all we can obtain for the moment because we don't have the uh, glowing mushroom and cave and stuff. All right, let's just make the glass from the remaining sand and pretty much I wait for the night to come and then we'll be ready for the first well actually the second but hope the first lucky boss fight in our world which will be really really fun and I'll quickly place the gems into the chest also to this next to the sapphires and shroom okay so now it's time just to wait for the night and then We'll start in epic IF2 fight. Um, while it's raining hard here, I'm making some grey bricks. Um, okay, for the reason is that I'm updating the fighting arena a little bit. I want it to look, you know, better, swifter, not with this mud blocks and stuff. So that's what I'm doing. Basically, making it look more. Uh, just better I would say just making it look better that's what I mean pretty much okay because with this George it looks looks just a bit noobie you know I wanted to make I wanted to look as cool as possible all right and I also made the ice torches yep this is also a little bonus okay so we can easily go for this yep then I wouldn't replace those on the other side 
I also place a nice torch over here. Oh, first of all, we should remove the door blocks. It's all fighting place. <laughs> to beat all the monsters. And now just prepare the weapons. Okay, we also must consume this thing. Oh, we have another blinker. Alright then, let's make one more swiftness potion. Oh, but I forgot about the summoner. Okay, do we have any lenses left? Okay, we have only three. We need three more lenses. That's not cool, because I thought that we'll be able to fight him this night. Won't we be able to do so, guys? Is it really happening? I thought we had everything ready for the fight, finally. But it looks like we need more preparations. How do I split it? Yes, go back to the chest. Okay, okay. Right, something like this. So, how do I get more lenses quickly? Don't have an answer for this at the moment. That is not great. Oh, glasses, species looking eye. Six lenses are needed, that's all I can say. So we should wait for the night and fight some more monsters around. And only then we'll be able to get our suspicious looking eye. Our summoner. Okay, okay. Maybe make the arena wider, you know have this idea hmm also let's craft the lead axe why not we have all the equipment here everything's great but we don't have a lead axe so why not make one I think we don't have enough okay let's make a silver one then who cares hey oh now I don't have enough wood <laughs> Okay, great. Let's go get some over here. Because we're still using the Cooper one. That's not what I want to do. Um, did we get our acorn? No, we didn't even get an acorn. Alright. But now we're ready to make a silver axe. This one had all full stats. And this one has... Oh, it's godly. OMG, awesome, awesome. So let's just sell it to this guy. Why not? 80 Cooper. Sell. <laughs> there it goes. And now we have an amazing thingy. Godly Silver Axe. KKK. Let's go do some mining. Because the monsters aren't willing to come anywhere now we're pros with wood mining <laughs> wood collecting I would say not mining of course uh, do I place it there? yeah ok another acorn another tree has been planted let's get rid of this random one and just get some more wood perhaps update the arena as I said okay many slimes here many random things happening you feel an even presence watching you what the heck is it some scary monster willing to kill me and now a goblin army finally decided to show up and we have to deal with all these bad guys without getting shot by the crazy archer army how do I throw grenades at them even? I have no idea if being honest okay should point somewhere over there oh no not at myself actually just like point there and throw the grenades is the best thing I can do. 
too many goblins that's crazy amount of those really crazy amount but we're doing something actually i'm damaging them and pretty nice oh okay but they they found a way how to get close to me <laughs> so now we have a goblin army and that's fun because they may uh, give us the harpoon which i think i already have yeah but i have a harpoon but there is a bad guy he'll probably kill me right now uh, but what I want to say, the fight is fun, because we may be able to make a grappling hook later on. And also get a plenty of money, and then we'll probably be able to buy the mini shark after the fight. But there are just too many goblins, and they probably will shoot me with all these arrows. But alright, we'll see how it goes, uh, we'll see how the fight goes, and it should be a lot of fun to be honest. <laughs> just have a look at this. All the archers are shooting at the same moment. There is a crazy amount of arrows just coming straight to me. That is OMG. That is like OMG, guys. I have no words. <laughs> no words, honestly. There is a total crazy amount of those guys. What the heck? Have you seen it? <laughs> have you seen all those arrows fly just at once? That is something, that is something actually. That's real Terraria. That's how the fights here go around. Not even understanding if I'm shooting those guys or not. Some arrows are getting to a place, some arrows don't. But something crazy is happening. Just have a look at this. They're all shooting at the same moment, just arrows flying all around. That is some crazy skills over here shooting the arrows from the upside to this goblin army to these archers they are willing to kill me but i'm stronger than those ones i'm making it <laughs> making it somehow there is the sorcerer get away yep 100 percent goblin panzer an achievement we made it but these guys don't want to go away they still don't want to go away, but I have my rifle ready. They're going somewhere, finally. Okay, Archer, no. You won't do anything to me now. Now I'm powerful when ready. And I think all the guys will go here. This will be crazy. Oh, are they out? They're finally out of the world. No way that's happening. Only the arms dealer has survived only that freaking guy has survived do you understand how crazy this fight was nothing left just pure destruction and the guide is back okay we have a harpoon now anyways <laughs> that was so fun that was so fun we beat the goblin army off okay all i can say is let's get rid of all these graves because they look awful Let's just get everything away from our fighting spot. And we made it. I'll repeat it once again. We've beaten the Goblin Army in expert solo. No preparation. It just came here. I didn't want this to happen. But <laughs> they just said, no way, man. No way. You're gonna fight us. And we beat them off. We did it. <laughs> so, right. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode, that was so long, but that was so fun, so many things happened. Finally have our swiftness potions, all these things ready. So only one more lance is needed for the crazy IF2 who fight, but we'll do it anyways. Um, the only thing is the NPCs have to respawn, but everything will happen and we'll do it in the next episode. So thank you guys for watching, hope you had a lot of fun, don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. That was me Damir35, see you guys in the next episode, bye and have loads of fun.